And now on Pet Pals TV, look who we got here. Look. Oh, a handsome boy. Oh, of course, Tom Dog. Oh. <laughs> with Noah's. <laughs> and also we have Harry. Harry is my new dog, a rescue from Grateful Rescue and Sanctuary. And tell me what you found out. First, let me say this. Yeah. When I got him, they said, well, maybe he's three, four, five years old. What did you find out? Well, here's the important thing about doing a physical exam, right? <laughs> Is that we can tell a lot from a physical exam. It's nice that maybe he had, you know, one owner who had him for a couple of years or whatever, but if you really don't know the whole history, yeah. we looked and we think he's probably closer to six, maybe up to eight. Eight? Yeah, so, but yeah. you know, he's a small breed dog. So they last. Yeah, oh, he's God. probably middle aged, Okay. like both of us. <laughs> I see what you did there. Yeah. Okay, uh, and also, w w people, everybody's asking me because I've got up on Facebook. Said, "What is he? He is a what we do you think? think? He's a West Highland White Terrier mix. mix. Definitely a terrier mix. I, you could see maybe some Maltese in his face okay. right there. So you know, he's probably got several different breeds, and maybe one day we'll do a DNA test on him." We'll see. We'll find out. We'll find out what you are. Yes, we will. All right. We'll find out. Oh, my Stewie loves him. They're, they're bonded. They go out and they pee together, so they need to do that. And also, the cats love him, too, so we're, we're, everything's fine. Good. But it, it does take a while when you bring a new animal in to your house. I right. Mean, it just, it does. Yeah, they, who knows what his history's been. Right. It's going to take a few days for him to settle down, a few weeks to build up a routine, and then even maybe some months just to have all that trust and everything. But the good news is his health exam came out fine. His blood work came out fine. And so I think the important thing here is don't be afraid to buy or adopt from a rescue, right? Mm -hmm. This is something, I mean, he's, as far as we know, absolutely healthy. Yeah, yeah. Well, I know Pamela Trahune with the Grateful Rescue Sanctuary. Uh, they took him to the vet there and had, you know, some preliminary mm -hmm. things done. And why do I call him Harry? Because when they, when they first got him out of the, uh, the uh, rescue, out of the, uh, I'm sorry, the shelter, the Muncie shelter, he almost didn't have any hair because what was wrong with him? He has dermatitis or something? Well, we don't know exactly what was wrong. Okay. Um, certainly he could have had fleas. What I see right here yeah. is indicative of a pattern of fleas okay. and they gave him flea control. Yeah. He could have environmental allergies, which is very common. We talked about that before in right. previous episodes. And you can find that online at Pet Pals TV. Okay. Um, and then food allergies, that's a possibility. Okay. That takes a lot longer to find out. That would take yeah. like eight to 12 weeks. So let's start with where we're at right now and see how he does. Okay. Well, he's, he's doing very well. He's very loving. Uh, and uh, Dr. Rachel is, Dr. The, Rachel. is yep. the one who examined him. And we have your full records now, so you can't get away with anything anymore. She said he might have cataracts, too. And again, that goes back to the age, yeah. right? This is a, you know, certainly we can have young dogs with cataracts if but, they have other diseases, but probably his age again, these are probably mature cataracts, are getting to okay. be mature cataracts because of his age. And uh, also the teeth. She noticed the teeth. Yeah, we yeah. a lot of times we'll look, we'll flip up the lip like this and look for wear and tear. We'll look to see how much tartar uh, is on the teeth and things yeah. like that. That can give us, it's not perfect, but, uh, but it can give us an idea. Yes, it can. <laughs> Well, you're a good boy, and you're a good boy. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and uh, Harry is his name, and uh, he's getting along fine with everybody. So I needed something, someone to replace, not replace, to help in the spot that Mabel used to fill uh, to get Stewie up and moving around because he's older now, too. When Harry met Patty. Yeah. Oh, uh, <laughs> Harry met Patty. He's so funny. Can we come over here? Okay, no, we got to do the rest of the show. All right. Okay, thank you, Tom Doc, and appreciate all that you do. And uh, we'll be back with more on Pet Pals TV. Go see your vet.